There's too much light. My blessed mess forsaken! These fairy tales are much too clean, so dull and dry. I light the stream of warm bleak. I'll craft them dark to make them grim. That's my hallmark. My guts fill up with pretty tales. Their prissy cuteness never fails to make me peel. To lose my wits, to pluck my teeth and give me fits. Now the rents is stale and foul. Despise the happy ending. Gross and nasty make me howl. Though they may be offending. I'm here to build two tales of light. Of fear and woe bring back the light. I ain't dumb luck. A door of tuck. My humble goal is to run the <laughs> Hi, everyone. My name is Kobaloy, and this week I'm going to be playing Grimm, um, the episode Beauty and the Beast. Uh, so I'm not doing this in order. I'm going to be swapping back with uh, Karak. She's going to be playing some of the episodes, and I'm going to be playing others, so it's not going in order. Uh, this game available on Steam, and yeah, it's based on Grimm's fairy tales, basically. I don't know too terribly much about it, so let's go right into it. Actually, let's check out instructions. Maybe that might help. Uh, turns from light to dark. Powers to transform cute, happy fairy tales into dark, bloody stories. The way they were meant to be seen, actually, if you knew that. Uh, dark meter to the next level to dark and bigger and bigger things. Okay. Begin to pee. Classy. Uh, jump to Madoka. Okay. Butt stomp. Okay. Clean, dirty work. Okay. So let's go. Okay. This incredible tale of beauty and her beast would earn my highest recommendation were it more about bizarre enchantment and less about misguided love. <laughs> well, let's deal with it. The handsome family home is engulfed in flames. A grave cause for alarm, no? Everything's gone. The books, the furniture, the only portrait of Mama, my favorite stockings. Surely not the travels. I haven't had my tea. Luckily, I'm wearing my new pantaloons. And Father ships are afloat. I suppose there must be a doubloon or two about. Could you must. And I wasn't that fond of Mama. <laughs> Some losses are evidently easier to bear than others. Oh no, children! My entire fleet has been lost! We have been ruined by fire, misadventure, and... and oh no! <laughs> Father made one ultimately futile attempt to recover a portion of his assets. On his return from the city, and because he couldn't find ice at the North Pole, He's <laughs> hopelessly lost. These snow creatures are useless. No, nothings. But you'd think the blasted horse could find his way home. Perhaps oh, yeah. I am the unluckiest man alive. Hungry, horseless, and cold, he stumbles into a castle. Incredibly, I state with prejudice, it's enchanted like a summer day with flowering gums, food, and surprise. I'll take a rose to beauty, my beautiful daughter. It should be capitalized. Just saying. I ah, gave ah, you hideous. shelter. Beast. When observed, I oh, gave God. you shelter. Mercy. <laughs> Such a bloody pipe. <laughs> I gave you shelter from the storm. Uh. You steal my flowers. But, 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 I could not imagine anyone would mind. Forget your butts. They will not save you from the death you deserve. The rose was for my daughter. Please, spare me! Hmm. On condition that you give me this precious daughter instead. Ah, uh, if I were cruel enough to buy my own life at her expense, what excuse? You are cruel enough. And coward too, I observe. <laughs> Take this gold and bring your daughter back to me post haste. If you fail to obey, I'll fetch you, and your end will become legend. Now father returns home with Beauty's rose and his asses loaded with the beast's gold. 
It appears a bitter ransom. To save my life, I promised beauty to a grotesque beast. He may kill her <laughs> or subject her to more <gasps> unspeakable practices. practices. Oh, does he have a beak? <laughs> rich. I'm sure he's not entirely horrible. <laughs> beauty, I have a scheme that needs a bit of funding. I wonder. Oh, oh. totally ready to go, Father. This is fantastic. Beauty to the beast, and she's less than terrified. Hmm, very interesting. After a cozy tour of the castle, she retires and falls asleep. And dreams. Of crabs? Okay. It's so weird. Like, every night I dream of a really hot prince who says I shouldn't trust appearances. What can it mean? Oh, brother. What is it about <laughs> obviously enchanted beasts and castles that she doesn't understand? A long last. Do you mean to eat me now? <laughs> no, beauty. I've come to ask you to marry me. You know, beast. I mean, I bet you got a decent personality, but my heart belongs to, uh, well, I mean, like, you're just hideous, okay? <laughs> ah, beauty, you're so unkind. I fear I'm fated to be miserable all my days. Well, if it's fated, say not girl or whatever. Can I go home to see my <laughs> family? I promise to return. I cannot refuse you anything, but remember your <sighs> Or you may have cause to repent it. For if you do not come back, I will surely die. Beauty's family has nice new digs. Purchased with the money secured by her attendance on a murderous beast. But no matter, it's joy and cuddles all around. You must be tired from your journey, Beauty. Perhaps you'd like a nap. Nap. By all means, long nap. Did you bring more gold? <laughs> to sleep, a chance to something or other. And every night she does dream, but not of the charming prince. Instead, she conjures up an image of the beast dying in his gum. <laughs> oh, better go back to the beast. Or maybe in his will. Oh my god. So she falls back asleep and wakes up back in the palace. Nice trick. When she finds the beast, he appears to have expired. He revives after Beauty douses him with water. Oh, beast, I think, I think I like, love you. And you really love such an ugly creature? Oh, for sure. We could buy a really neat <laughs> bag for your head and the castle <laughs> big and there's lots of really nice stuff like... Will you spend your life with this ferocious beast? Well, one or two items in writing, and it's a done deal. <laughs> Separate bedrooms might be best, and you'll stay out of sight when I have someone over. And like, don't bother my cat. You'll frighten her to death. Suddenly, the beast disappears, and in his place stands the prince of her dreams. Beauty's the only one who didn't see this coming. Please consent to be my wife. Wow, I consent. Do you have any brothers? I should meet my friends. I think they'd like really hit it off, you know. It took courage to redeem her father's pledge and to rescue the beast from his terrible enchantment. Still, I think she had some misgivings. They're alleged to have lived happily ever after. Double bleh. The quantity of puerile pap between the conflagration that began the tale and the premarital transformation with which it ended was enough to choke a hippopotamus. Need a drink to clear your throat? A little bit, yeah. If so, play on. <laughs> well, that was quite a long introduction, but... Beauty's house burns down and the family loses everything in it. Oh, it would break my tender heart if I had one. Let's incinerate the whole village. That sounds like fun. Gross. That sounds like fun. Ooh. Let's move. Okay. 
So that was interesting. What the sheep make it clean? Oh, that's not fun. Boom. <laughs> Ooh, this is fun. Okay. Did you ever wish you could just land on your ass and, you know, make everything all black and destroyed? Now you can! Boom! <laughs> Stupid sheep. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Boom! <laughs> just go and burn up, burn, baby, burn. Just saying. Yeah, I, I like the fact that they actually point out the fact that, hey, it's not that hard to, to marry a hideous, disgusting beast when, you know, he's rich. He's got money. Just one ship? Let's destroy the whole flotilla. This is fun. Make it rotten. I like this game. Okay, where do I go? Okay, gotta go over here. Now, I now. Ooh, this is fun. Oh, what's that thingy? Let's like get this all icky too. Ooh, cool. Or oops. Whoopsie doodle. No. Okay. Running, running, running. No! Crap. Oh, I guess that's what they're talking. Boom. I guess that's what they were talking about when it came to the P. Oh. Ay ay ay. Boom. Bad stomp it. We're going. Okay, run, 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 stinky little man. Let's go! Whee! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Damn. I missed that little coin thing, but... <laughs> I like this guy. I really like this guy. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm I'm really liking this game. I don't know how long these episodes are or anything like. Oh, okay. I guess is that just the scene? Oh, secrets collecting. Okay. The flaming Father pea power. His lost fortune was an utter <laughs> failure. All he found was a cold. Too bad he escaped the pirates. Well, at least we can make it hoary. Hoary. Okay. Make it gross. Oh, this will be fun. Let's I'm having way too much. Okay. Mm. Oh, shh. Okay. Oops. I guess I'm not supposed to go down there. Just maybe. Oh, God. Where's my... Ah, here it is. Oh, I'm supposed. To oh, I guess I get it. Okay. It's kind of hard to tell where all the stuff. Go. Stop peeing on everything. Keep going. Or not. Stupid people, stop cleaning it! Stop it! Something 
making everything all nice and cute and pretty and clean and beautiful. Okay. Oh, let's wreck the house. Stop it! Yeah. Now where'd he go? Where is he? <laughs> I f go, go, go. How do I? How do I get there? Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh God, How do I get there? No, 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 no. Mother. You suck. <sighs> Why are there these giant holes in the middle of the fucking street? Just gonna point that out here. No, don't slide, you little. Yeah. Where the? <sighs> Just sliding all over Hell's Half Acre. How the fuck do I get there? There you are. Jesus. Jesus. Well, that's a little bit more. Okay. What well, can I can I go? Stop it good. Oh, I guess I already got to rotten, so I was key on everything. You did me, but stop away. Ooh. Too fierce looking brute. Stop it. <laughs> Shards of glass in them? Ay ay ay. Does the lupine brain complain? Um, Yeti again. Don't eat too fast for me. You'll get cramps. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Do you just like glide over that? Wanders up to an enchanted castle. What luck? Whatever he finds inside makes short work of him. Make it nasty. I have to. Oh crap! I'm gonna fall so much. Oh, okay. Don't delay, but stomp away. Oh crap! I'm gonna fall so much. Wish I could like save. Hmm. Never been good with platformers. <laughs> I did it! Boom! Don't fence me in. Let's get out of the cold. My pee's starting to freeze. Can you imagine how much he'd have to drink all the time to pee that much? All the time. All the time. Dear lord. Oh, okay. Um, hmm. I guess I'll do one more scene and then I'll call it quits for tonight. Because that intro was pretty long, but yeah, these are kind of fun. Uh, game time. Not only does okay. Father find sweet summer in the middle of a winter storm, a warm meal appears before him. Oh, oh. the power of magic! But he still looks chilled. Make it foul. <laughs> let's yes, let's. Oh, those are demonic looking teddy bears. Or. Oh. oh, would you stop cleaning it? Stupid, the snails!
Ugh. Ugh, that sound. Would you stop it? Oh, dear lord. The flames of hell. <laughs> yeah, it brings out the burnt in his skin, you know. Oh, God, that's gross. <laughs> okay. Oh! Oh, sorry. Guess I should not do that, huh? Let's... Whoa! I can't. That was weird. Sorry. Who designs their castle like this, by the way? Who did I get? Did I get a thingy? I got a thingy. I think. I think I didn't pay that much attention. Thingy thong thing. Thingamajigger, what you call it? Father is caught red-handed by the beast. Oh no! Punishment for stealing roses. His daughter, in exchange for his life, doesn't seem bothered by the prospect, does he? No, Let's not really. Let's make him suffer. Okay. Yeah, it's like make it disgusting. Okay. Stupid cats cleaning everything. I love the butt stomp. Okay, keep going. It's like the best thing ever! Doesn't it seem- you know, the original Grimm's fairy tales were actually like super duper, um, dark. Like, Cinderella. Her, she made her stepsisters. So one of them, I can't remember which one made them her dance in red hot iron shoes. Like I don't know if it was Cinderella or not, but it was one of them. Ooh. So that's a beast. Yeah, that that's a beast, not the other thing. But yeah, no. Um, Grimm's fairy tales were actually originally very very dark. Um, so yeah, that was scene three. I think I'm going to end it here. So thank you for watching everyone. Um, I hope you, I will see you next week where we continue off with this. Um, and